ready to go fishing? Oh yes. Then let's go. What's up, what's up everybody? Back out here for another video. Uh out here for a rockaway today. It is low tide. Another after work video. Haven't been doing this for a couple of weeks. Took a little break from fishing. But I'm out here. Today I got a two ounce river sinker because there do be a lot of current over here. So hopefully I can stay light with this and it doesn't get pushed over. And I got some sandworms on a 1-0 Gamagasu octopus hook. Hoping to get some porgies. Hopefully they came down this far. If I can get some porgies, the spots if they still here, blowfish. Get it on out there. The only thing I don't like is that it's low tide, man. I don't know. It's actually really low. I didn't even check the tide. I just came out after work. Went and bought some bait. Came through. But let's see what happens. We out there. I didn't take long. Just got the first hit. It ain't look like nothing crazy. There was something busting on this bait right here. A peanut bunker. Oh, I just got hit again. Wow, a lot of peanut bunker. If only had a cast net. No blues on them, no weak fish. Big school of peanut bunker. Big. Not fighting like no porgy. What do we have here? A little sea bass. Man, these guys is all over the place, man. These, these little sea bass is everywhere right now. You guys are a nuisance when you're this size. this far. Like, yo, was your brother to read outdoors? That's what he said? Yeah, he asked him. Nice. If you can hit the algorithm, that's when it really shoots up when it starts recommending it to people. Hey, it feels like another sea bass, man. There's freaking sea bass is all over the place. God dang. 
was coming up or going out? Bro, I didn't even check out of you though. It looked like it's going out. I didn't even check the tide, I just wanted to go fishing. Freaking sea bass, man. Hey, that looked like a better bite. What is that? What is it, a little porgy? It's not fighting like a sea bass. But it ain't fighting like no big porgy. We got the right species. It's not the right size. No point in measuring that. Oh yeah, big ones too. Got my guy Umid out here. Came out and met me. We got my boy Nico out here. He just started his YouTube channel. Check him out. Uh, uh, subscribe to my channel. It's Fishing with Nico. Fishing with Nico. I'll put the link in the description. Hopefully, we get a video out of today. <laughs> Forget. Looking like all baby fish right now. Why are you always hating, son? They on a boat, though. We over here. <laughs> always hating. Umi walks right up and gets a little croaker. I mean, a little spot. That would make good uh, weak fish bait. Here, happy birthday. Yeah, that was too small. I ain't keeping that little one. <laughs> I'd rather use that one for bait. I didn't, I didn't break my second rod though. Yo, they're going for tuna Sunday. You want to come? No, nah, I got a playoff game. I got to work Saturday and then I got a game Sunday. And they caught the cobia not too far from the tank, so 70 feet. You got a boat? Everybody going out there. Thinking about just putting this video out as like a long, continuous video. Long, uncut clips. Of me catching nothing. <laughs> like they be doing down south. What the heck? Yeah, he picked it up as soon as it hit the bottom. It's small, whatever it is. Yeah, he picked it up as before I could even close the bell. Did he get off? It must be a sea bass. Is it ain't fighting? What do we have here? Uh, I mean, we get in a multi-species video. I mean, I could eat this, but I could eat it, but I don't know how many I would catch. This bunker. <laughs> I don't know how many of these little guys I'm gonna catch. They're not biting that good. Oh wait, what was the record again? Oh shoot. take a picture and measure them I don't know if anybody did the catch and release I'll take the catch and release record if anything first I have to get a measurement on him let's see what we got what we got all right all right all right relax dang Seven inches definitely ain't the record, but they got catch and release. Oh crap. Come on, bro. Come on, bro. Seven inches. Here we go.
11 inches for the catch and release. There he goes. Now I'm be tight if I catch two more of those. <laughs> yeah. Uh, I'm really gonna be tight if another one bites right away. I need to look it up and see what the record is. Yo! Oh, that's the bunker, right? Dang, this one. Closer, the one closer to me, yeah. That just got hit. Something was on it. Uh oh, that's why I hate using the bells. <laughs> Take the bell off. <laughs> that's the you got bunk on there, right? Yeah. Might have been a sea robin, man. The way that hit was. Got him? Alright. What it feel like? See Robin? Oh dang. What'd you throw? That peanut bunker? Big old surf ride. <laughs> oh, shit, oh, oh, what is, what is that? A shark. Oh, a dogfish. I, I called that before too. I told you a bunch of dogfish over here. Yeah. That's content, baby. Better than nothing. <laughs> Damn, if I don't know it was on, I would have used the other camera to film you. <laughs> Need a big one. Oh. Hey, you walk right by it too. You didn't even check. <laughs> Dang, he got away. Yeah, he was hitting it that whole time until I touched the rod. Yo, why is the wind picking up like this? There was no wind when I got here. Yo, they left. They they parked up on there on purpose. What the heck was they doing? They were on the beach. Trying to catch you Instagram. Yeah, yeah. The lights, right? Didn't get skunked. At least got a small dogfish. Going back in the water, though. <laughs> All right, so none of us got skunked. This is nice. <laughs> so that I can release this as a long, uncut video. <laughs> Show what goes on behind the scenes. Changing bait, taking pictures. Instead of doing the clips. Every now and then I probably just cut it. See how I take my bait out, I hold them like this so he can't bite me. Put the hook right through the head, down or get it on on there. If anybody's even watching this far into the video, I know it's not that much action. But you never know what might happen. I say long uncut video and the camera dies. Huh? Oh yeah, yeah. With the light ride, you feel everything. A light ride is some brakes. The smallest taps. Nope. Uh, 
fish came. Nah, that's a little tiny taps. Come on, eat it. It's a lot of little fish. Oh, let me look up and see what this record is. Real quick. Instagram. Fishing records. Oh, what? Don't take rules, watershed. Non release. Uh, spot. Dang. Eight inches. And so it would have catch and release. Bong. Nobody got the spot. Catch and release. I released them, seven inches, that's a new record. I'm, I'm sending that in. Get my name back up for the spot. If I catch one over eight inches, I'm keeping that. I'll take both records. I probably just got cleaned out though. But yeah, check them out on Instagram, NYC Fishing Records. Part of the Book and Fishing Club. That's fun, like if you're out fishing, you never know. Yeah, what you shoot? You shoot it wide or you shoot it linear? Well, mine's only has one setting, so whatever that is. Because <laughs> I'm thinking like, you see more. Look at this. Like, you see more with the setting that I'm in now, but it's like, when I got the fish in the camera, yeah, you can't really see it that clearly. Oh, you're doing it straight to your phone already? This is fine. See, I don't even be going over mine until I get home. So a lot of times my camera's even pointed the wrong angle on my head. I don't even know. Which GoPro do you have? Nine. Nine. Right, see, yeah. Uh, you up there. I'm, I'm using seven. I'm using uh I got two sevens and they're the ones that you charge. So while one's charging, I use one. And then I just switch the memory card out when it dies. How long it lasts? It lasts like two, two hours. Two, two and a half hours. Well, I just have the portable charger and I switch them out. Look at this. As soon as it hit the bottom, they bite it. Come on, be a big old spot. Nine inches or better. Little taps. Yeah, I caught I caught a sea bass doing that. Look at this. Come on, man. I don't really want to put a smaller hook on. I want some nicer fish. And you see this better with the uncut. You see how I pick the rod up and I wait. I be watching people, they see their rod getting bit, they just pick it up and just start reeling. Or they pick it up, swing on it and start reeling. I wait. I want to feel that fish hit. And if they pick up the single, even better, because when you stick them, you know they got that hook in their mouth. Where the heck are all these waves coming from? About to check this bait. Oh, way too many bait snatchers around. It's dead low tide. Yo. Oh, they came back. Yeah, this is how they was before when they came over. Bunch of peanut bunker. Well, 
That's all I said over there. You see how they was pushed up to the top? Something was underneath them. The crazy thing is, one of my packages had a blowworm in there. And I put it on, and that blowworm didn't get touched for some reason. But these sandworms is getting hit like crazy. Which is weird. I gotta stop putting the whole sandworm on. <laughs> He ain't coming out this late. You see him under the water? Oh, him? So we out here just hanging out. I already said my guy Umid out here. Got Nico. Fishing with Nico. Doing more of an uncut video. See what else happens. Caught some sea bass. Got a little porgy. I got a spot, which is a record. And nobody got the catch and release record. So I'm gonna send that in soon. If I catch one bigger than that, I ain't throwing it back, dude. Be kind of upset that I threw that one back. I mean, they only get like 10, 10, 11 inches anyway. And they taste good. Down south, they really use them. They use them for bait. Usually I do a trip down to Denver, I mean not Denver, to Delaware or Virginia, my boy Deuce go down to catch them spots and croakers kingfish I ain't go this year next trip might be Orlando though next month don't know yet bro I threw the whole worm out now now it's not getting hit oh wait 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 Something hit it. I'm going to take it. I feel you. Come on, come on. Ah, I missed him. Whatever it is, it's small. You got him? Cleaned you? I got one O's. Bunch of bait snatches. Probably a lot of baby blowfish too. Spotfish. Just blow fuckers. Their mouth is like, you know, it comes out like a cop spot. There's any bait left on this hook right now. That's the one thing too about these little fish. You get hit a couple of times, they might have just took the holes, especially with some sandworms. They take sandworms right off the hook. Yep. He was one of the first people I started watching. I learned a lot from him. He didn't even know it. I ran into him on the Cross Bay Bridge. Oh yeah, I remember that last year. Yeah. <laughs> so we out here. What you call it, porgy? I got a porgy, sea bass, and spot. 
Actually, the spot I quit is gonna be entered for the record for the NYC fishing records. Wait, hold on, say that one more time. Said so the I got sea bass and I got a little porgy. I got a spot, a spot which I'm actually gonna enter for the record for the NYC fishing records. I released it for the catch and release. I had the one uh, the non-release, but somebody beat it, so I'm trying to beat that right now too. If I catch a bigger spot. We need is one big bite. Come on. One big bite. He got his rod spread. <laughs> Once the sun go down, and dogfish are gonna really start hitting. You have to make them put them rods closer together. I don't know how late I'm gonna stay. I wanna go watch this football game. Okay. Oh yeah, your drag's so loose. <laughs> what is it, low porgy? Oh, oh, oh. I was gonna come film you. Okay. What the? What is it? Low porgy? <laughs> Little fish coming up. Oh me with a little porgy. What I got? This thing not even fighting. Another spot. Another spot. Ah, maybe I should have kept all three of them. <laughs> Dang, son. You get hit? You get a measurement on this one. I don't even think this one longer than seven inches. All right, all right, all right, all right, bro. We know, we know you. Don't worry, bro. You going back? You going back? I keep no little tiny fish, bro. It's like six and a half inches. Just to go back. Don't worry, bro. I need a big, big one. The spots are here, though. I mean, if I was doing uh catching cook on the water right now shoot them, them little spots be going there ain't no size limit be going right on the, on the grill right now come on there's little spots there there's definitely gotta be some big ones here come on It's kind of nice not having to turn the camera off and on. Worried about if it's on. It's constantly on. I'm not really even going to edit this. I'm just put it together. Just make a long video. Some people be asking me for longer videos, but I mean, like, I'm sure they be wanting more action than this. But but that's what I be out here doing. In between clips, I just cut it to where I catch the fish for you guys. We can test this out and try it. You can always leave in the comment. Let me know how you, what you thought. This freaking wind picking up is bad. Can't see these little bites. 
come on. Come back for it. Come on, come on, come on. Oh, <laughs> nah. He came back for it too. He still missed him. It's like they just take it in mouth real quick and spit it out. Well, I know there's gotta be some big spots out there. Oh, big bogey. Hopefully, I didn't get my bait. Okay, okay. You didn't get the bait. You didn't get the bait. Yo, what the freak? I actually picked the sink up. I still didn't get him. That's another thing y'all don't be seeing. All the fish I miss. <laughs> In between clips. I think he might have got the bait that time. This ride is so smooth. It's real smooth and quiet. Uh, still a little bait left. Nice size sandworm. I ain't gonna put this whole thing on there. Right to the head. Give it through a couple times. Cut it small. Where the freak are all these waves coming from? Get that on out there! <laughs> I got a two ounce river sinker, the flat one. Dead low tide. I mean, the last time the spots was here, I was catching them slack, dead low, high, didn't matter. Last time they said it was way bigger than this. We just catching nice ones, man. That should be out all night. Yeah, the wave came in, hit the wall, and went back out. <laughs> like a swimming pool. Crazy to know, just a mile or two down that way, freaking huge porgies. Right here, we can't get one big porgy. I'm happy with the spots, I just need them to be bigger. Oh, 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 that was a bite. That was a bite. Come on. I know. At the gas station? Yo, how am I not hooking these fish, yo? How small do they gotta be? Nobody got that bait off. I only put the head of the sandworm. Dang, man. That was a good bite, too. Not a pogey bite, but... What time is it? 647. Take it. 
Shoot, man. Spot, straight down. Wow. <laughs> There's a whole bunch of them here. Might just switch to the smaller hooks. Ain't no big pogies anyway. Dang, maybe I should have kept them. <laughs> that, bro, that would have been four already. I don't feel like cleaning no fish tonight anyway. Even though they are easy to clean. Dang, they, they might have cleaned me now. Are these, I was about to say, that's pulling too hard. That'd be a spot. <laughs> a little piece of bait. Go straight down. Record spot right now. What you got on there? What you got on there? Pogi rig. Pogi rig? Or bait? Yeah, yeah sandworms. <laughs> I'm getting hit right here, it's just baby taps. Probably baby, baby blowfish. <laughs> I don't want to do this. Come on. I need some. I need another record spot. Somebody took my record, man. I want to get it back. Right now, I got the catch and release, man. I'll keep one just to take the record. What is that? Porgy? I use those for trout. Huh? I use those for trout. The, the rat tails. Power beat rat tail. Got hit. There's, yo, there's mad fish out there. Just babies, man. Hey. See bass? <laughs> Oh, is that a blackfish? That's a blackfish. Oh, oh no, that's a sea bass. That's a sea bass, yeah. yeah. And when he was flipping around, I was like, hold on. Am I going for one? Yeah. All right, we're getting hit. Baby taps, though. These little tiny ones, I can't hook them with this one off. I don't want to put the tiny hook on, though. Give me a good, good bite. Get that hook in your mouth. Come on, yeah. Come on, pick the hook. Take the hooky. Oh my gosh. Off again. Might have got the bait too.
fish. <laughs> I feel like that's what I'm getting bit by out there. Tiny, tiny little sea bass. Dang, son. Some bites look better. Go set the hook, you still can't get them. So but every afternoon, freaking every evening, the wind just picks up. Same thing happening when I'm at the bridge. Oh man, there's still a little piece, a little piece of bait on it. They eat it right up to the hook. talking and stuff like this is a live video treating this like a live video just the cameras on my head instead of pointing towards me back on out there <laughs> oh shit! Oh fuck! Yeah, yeah. <laughs> Got him. Yeah. <laughs> Another sea bass. A whole lot of sea bass. Got you. Come on. Got me on the spine, yo. Uh, yo, how am I not hooking these fish, bro? Like, how small can they be? Just tapping it, tapping it, tapping it. The heck is that? Boggy? That one was way too small. <laughs> Might as well not even. Uh oh. <laughs> That's the bunker? That was a good hit. Right? <laughs> Yo, as it gets dark, the, the shark's gonna start hitting the bunker. That's probably a shark. <laughs> that was you whistling? Jet ski still out here. They probably got wetsuits on.
fish don't want to bite unless you put the rod down. Shark bite. I was here one night with my uncle. I wasn't even filming, yo. I caught mad sharks. I, I was putting in my story, but I wasn't. I wasn't filming. Caught a bunch of sharks. Lost a big, a big bluefish right here at the wall. I feel like putting my light on and fishing through the night. I gotta work tomorrow. Probably going to film tomorrow. With Joe, you take his son and my nephew out for trigger fish. Then I gotta work Saturday. Got a playoff game Sunday. Might not film Sunday. So I'm hitting it. Like it's like a weird pull. Look at these little taps, man. What you got? See bass? Nobody got skunked. Just out here relaxing on the water. Look at these bites, man. What the heck? That's like a better bite. That thing picked the sink up and came towards me. It's still not on it. What the heck? Yo, this don't make no sense. There goes the sun. How small is this? What is this? What do we have now? Another spot. Oh my god, I should have kept all of them. <laughs> I should have kept Yo, I might keep this one. I don't even care. Uh, can't right off the hook, too. Alright, this one might be longer than seven inches. Hold on. What? Really? Yeah, shut up. <laughs> I was gonna put down the cameras, another species. For the day. I can't be. You just said that there was blackfish here. I wouldn't expect them to be caught right here. Under the bridge, yeah. What we got? Relax, buddy. I don't think I'm keeping any fish today. Uh, seven inches again. <sighs> Come on. I want to get the other record back. Put that little piece of bait out there. I know. I got it all on camera. That was another seven inches. I need one that's nine. Eight a tie, but I don't know if I want to keep them now. I ain't keep none of them. I want to keep one fish just to get the record.
Oh, whoa, whoa, okay, what was that? Oh, come on, come on, come on, come on. Missed it. He had it. Hey, he had it, I missed him. I didn't swing on it. From a good bite to back to little taps. Yo. Stuck? Back. <laughs> oh, you, you have it blurred out? Sandworms. Ah. A little porgy? <laughs> I don't have a blood worm. I, I had a blood worm, they didn't touch it. No, 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 no. Nope. The sandworms, they're eating the sandworm. Yeah. What are you using? Clam? Huh? You're using clam? I have a good uh, chip. Bunker? I don't have the blood one. Yeah. Blood one and the bunker is like the blood one. Blood one is too expensive. Yeah, it's too dollars. It's too much money. Today I don't have any so we have blood one. Use blood worms and you come here fucking bunch of baby fish? It's all small fish. <laughs> Not good. You gotta go closer to the bridge. The Marine Parkway? Marine Park They're me? catching big porgies over there. Oh, yeah. Can I go to Marine Park? The Google map? You know the bridge? This is the next bridge down? All the way down? Okay, can I show this, this here? Yeah. Oh, yeah. Oh, yeah. Oh. Marine Parkway? Mm hmm. Bridge in the town? Yeah, over there. Killing the porgies over there. Uh, on the, this side or this side? Both sides. Both sides? Yeah, underneath it. Every, mostly people on the on the boats. But I oh, seen I seen people catching from shore too. In the boat? Yeah. Stacked over there. You wanna buy this for hire? In the boat? I bought it at Cross Bay. Cross Bay? Yeah, the bait and tackle. Dead low tide. What time is coming here? I got here like almost five. Five, five, uh, five o'clock I got here. Oh, uh, afternoon five o'clock. Yeah, I came after work. Uh, the tide's the going. And then the yeah. No, when it get dark, the bluefish come. Bluefish and sharks. You Use bunker. Here? Yeah. I don't like the shark. You don't like shark? <laughs> no, I don't like shark. Good fight. Yeah, bluefish. I catch bluefish here too. Yo, come on. Look at these little taps. I know. Huh? <laughs> Get out of here, I'm gonna catch this football game.
Oh, here comes the peanut bunker. That gotta be 16 inches. <laughs> Baby taps. About to throw a piece of bunker on. Go for a shark. <laughs> Peanut monkey just went by again, going that way. I like his clamps. Huh? I like his clamps thick. Yeah. yeah. Still got a little piece of bait. Throw a little piece of bait out there. I don't know. Get it on out there. Get it on out there. I started on the second one. You done over there? No, there's still some in it. Plenty in it. Don't matter to me. Probably another shark. They be doing that. They hit, they turn around, they hit it again, turn around. Even on the boats. Like when I'm black fishing and stuff. I feel, I know it's a shark because I feel it go like, duh, 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 like it's like a bouncing up and down. I, I know, I know it's a shark. Oh, me getting hit. 16 inch porgy over there. <laughs> Yo, that always be happening like when I'm fishing and people come up to me trying to get me to give them they see me throw all the fish back and they try to give me to give it like yo I'm throwing it back because I can't keep it. I'm not gonna give it to you. <laughs> you gonna be sitting there with the little fish in your bucket as soon as the game water come over and be like, oh he gave it to me. I'm like what? Yeah, right. <laughs> Yeah, you have your drag mad loose. You got a big mat of grass? You grass. What the heck? I haven't seen a blue claw in a minute. You want it? Hold on, let me get that on camera. <laughs> one hand, one, one, one claw. That's a good size one, too. That's gonna eat you, motherfucker. It's a male. Yep, it's a male. Yo, we had a bucket full of those. <laughs> big, a big blue crab. Yeah. yeah, he's ready too. Look at him. <laughs> ah! Oh, he got me. All right, all right relax, bro. Relax. 
can get a good shot of that. Oh, thing. yo, he got my, oh, he almost got my toe. Alright, don't move, don't lose your arm. You only got one. Get a good shot of that. Damn, auto focus. I'm gonna take it. I'm gonna put it on. Alright, here we go. You gonna get a picture of him? Turn him over. Look at the back. Look at the size. That's a big blue crab, bro. This is definitely a keeper. It only gotta be four and a half inches. You gonna keep him? Nah. If it, if I gotta one crab. If we was going for them, yeah. this would be a keeper. Definitely. That's a nice size claw too. Very nice. Here, grow nice back the other one if you can if you can make it. I wonder if you snatched out the claw off just now. <laughs> that's quality. That was a that's a good size one. I like having this is because when it gets too dark, the GoPro don't get confused. Yeah, I know. I, I got the light for my GoPro. You make lights for one? This. I put it under it and I put the camera on top. Oh, uh, no word. That's why it's mad bright, sir. I could cover those myself. Amazon. Okay, I was about to say, I thought I heard a bell. Them bunk is gonna start getting hit like crazy soon. Worms are slowing down. Nice chunky size worm one in. Imagine a striper show up right now. Schoolie! I haven't caught a schoolie in a minute. It's almost that time, baby. Fall run. God dang, that's a lot of bunker. Need the cast net. Look at all of that. I don't even, I probably can't even see that actually. <laughs> we gonna try to snag one? Yeah. Wait, you gonna try to snag with the regular hook? You gonna knock him out with the sinker first? You got one? Yep. Cobia! Peanut bunker. Should let him put that on the hook. <laughs> yeah, put this on a big hook, bro, and just cast that shit. Put that peanut bunker on there live. Yo, something mess with that bunker. <laughs> I know. Oh, so I just shot this snap. When it's something big, that shit gonna go. It's something messing with it, something small messing with it. That's the biggest one I got. A little fish eating that big worm up. Right over my line. Yeah, it is. Yeah. Go this way. Dancing to the poles. <sighs> you got hit?
they probably took that bee. <laughs> Sun is going down. Huh? Are you switching the rig? I thought you threw it out on that, on that, them little hooks. Yo, where the heck did all this wind come from? <laughs> you might get a weak fish. So look at these bikes. Start off looking good. Well, it's going to be good because it's going to be incoming. God dang, man. This is crazy. Oh, here come the street lights. This is tearing the worm up. I really don't want to bring none of these worms home. Really? Right here? What the heck? I know they are rocks right here, but they're close. <laughs> oh, what? Come on. They will bite the rods in my hand. You know they catching they catching the stripers by the river on oh, eels. I got a fish on. I know. I got a fish on right now. There's a fish on it. He's just stuck. The sink is stuck. Let me see. Oh yeah, you in there. I feel like the hook is... I feel the sinker going up and down. It's the hook that's stuck. If it was a sinker, sometimes you could pop the sinker out. That hook is dug in there. Alright guys, <laughs> it's starting to get too dark. We filming out here with this GoPro. So I'm about to cut this one short. I'm about to get out of here anyway because I want to catch this football game. It's Thursday night football, baby. My guy Umid out here. Stop came out here to catch some uh, short fish. Yo, he hates days like this when we catch short fish. I got Nico out here. Stuck Fish, right now. Remember, man, fishing with Nico. Check him out on YouTube. He's he's actually on 
my community page. I posted one of his his last video on the community page. So if you want to hit him up, give him a sub, check out a video. He got I think three videos right now. Yeah, three videos. Last one, his last one was fire too. And then he got one. He was in Staten Island. I actually want to go there too. Like I'm supposed to go there for two years now. I got a lot of coworkers out there that want to go fishing over there. But yeah, we out here, Jamaica Bay. Did catch some fish, just small. Got, got the record back. I'm gonna send that in probably when I get to the house. Still getting hit, but it's all little fish, man. But yeah, let me know. Like, I mean, this style of video would be crazy. I mean, if I was killing the big fish, like I could do it when I'm catching bigger fish too. But just a date, like just to get some content. Oh, what the heck is that? Yeah, just get get some content out here. Just feel like a little a little porgy. The way he ran with it too. Felt like a porgy, just small. Yeah, another little porgy. Can't believe this, man. Like it's not even that far away. They catching four pound porgies, bro. Four pound porgies. And here it's just babies. Crazy, man. Well, I know I said I was gonna get out of here, but uh, you know, I can't help it, man. I just caught a fish. I don't wanna get bit. Get that little porgy out there. Big one might have came through. Well, yeah, this, this style of content, man, I don't know. It's gonna be a long video, too. I ain't driving it. Got the ride back out there for a little bit longer. I don't know what the footage is gonna look like. I don't feel like putting the camera, the light on, because I ain't gonna stay. But yeah, I don't know how much that light is helping. It ain't completely pitch black not yet. Yeah. I should have just kept all those spots, man. God dang. <laughs> I should have kept all of those spots. I might come back with the little grill, put the frying pan on it, some oil, cook up them shits. I, I, I thought they'd say anything. If I cook right here on the grass. Oh, over here, bring the grill right here, right? Eh? Yeah. A little catch and cook. What pound test you got on it? I'm surprised it ain't pop yet. And he said the reason why those peanut bunker turned red, remember the nose was turning red? Yeah. Because it wasn't getting enough oxygen. Locks up. But there's so many of them in there. Even with the water running in and out, it's still a little space. Supposedly that they don't really like to, the fish don't like to hit those red nose for red bunkers. Says who? Wait, is Braid? It won't pop? Let's see. When I pull it, I feel it pulling something up. But... Oh, it might be bringing whatever that, that rock is, whatever it is. <laughs> there you go. Yeah. Uh, guys, uh, like that to be it. Oh, but, but, but. <laughs> Every time I say I'm about to leave or get hit. <laughs> Bro, no, it was touching it that whole time. That's oh, gonna be weird putting this video together. I'm definitely not gonna sit there and go over all that footage. So I'm just gonna put the clips together and put it out. But whatever's there is there. I ain't going over all of this. That's another thing with filming like this. Just sit there and go through every... Watch that whole clip, listen to every whole thing. Nah. Just gonna put the whole thing out. Let's just see. See what you guys' feedback is.
<laughs> Actually, it was a hard tap. Yeah, let me pack this stuff up now. <laughs> yep. How much is one box? Ten bucks? Yeah. Yeah. I'm out. Alright, where are you guys? Alright, work in the water. You fishing into the night? You fishing into the night? I wish if I had to work, I would have got my other rod. I would have got bunker. Cause it's gonna be an incoming tide too. Tight. Yeah. And I know them sharks is gonna start hitting too. That's still content, catching fish. I was catching some decent sized ones too. Garbage. Nope, all right guys, get this camera off because if I get another bite with the camera, I'm not gonna shut it off. But yo, let me know. Leave in the comments like what you think about this. It's gonna be a long video. I don't know if anybody's gonna make it this far, but yeah. Let us know what you think. And I'll catch you guys in the next one, man. Peace.